You can set up authentication for B2B SaaS applications using Kind, specifically the orgs feature, where you can have an org for each of the businesses that you serve. The thing with serving businesses though, is lots of businesses want lots of different things. So for authentication, it might be custom branding, maybe they just wanna use email and code, you may have a different business that wants to use Google login and MFA, and you may have an organization that wants to use Entra ID and a custom domain or something like that. The good thing is, on Kind, with advanced orgs, you can achieve all of that. Here I have a B2B application set up where I'm serving a whole bunch of different libraries which are represented as organizations on Kind. By the different libraries, I've been given different requirements for their authentication. So the Neural Nexus, they want to use email and code. Lamina Library wants to use Google with MFA and the Arcane Academy wants to use Entra ID and they want to have a custom domain. For the Neural Nexus, it looks like they want some custom branding and they want to use email and code. So what does that look like on Kind? If you head to your Kind organizations, click on that organization, so the Neural Nexus. Under brand, you can put the logo, you can add different themes, background color, background color for the buttons, etc. What else do they want? They wanted to use email and code. So if I go to authentication here, I can activate the advanced orgs feature and set custom auth for this organization. I want email and code, give that a save. So now if I log in with the neural nexus, you can see I have the custom branding, check my email, and I'm gonna get a code. Great, and I've been logged into the neural nexus. I've satisfied the requirements for this business, the neural nex nexus, but how can I do that for the Lamina library? Because they want Google and they want to have MFA. Let's check it out on Kind. So go to our organizations, the Lamina library. And here they wanted to have Google and MFA. So if I go to authentication here, let's set custom auth for this, set for Google, give that a save, and then want multi-factor authentication. So I'm enforcing MFA for this org. Hit it with a save. All right, cool. So back to the Lamina library. If I click it and log in, you can see now it's got login with Google, which is what they wanted. And now this is actually the MFA bit. So it's sending me a code. So I've got the code. I'll paste it in. Log in. And I've just used Google and an MFA code to log in to the Lamina library, which is what they want. And we'll do the final organization or the final library where they want Microsoft Entra ID and they want to have a custom domain of their own. So let's head off to the Arcane Academy, checking out our organizations, Arcane Academy. What do they want again? They wanted Entra ID, so under authentication, we're using custom auth for this org and we are setting up Entra ID. They also want to have a custom domain. So to set up a custom domain, there's just the custom domain tab. You can put in the domain that you own, set it up on your DNS provider, and once it's provisioned, you'll be good to go. Let's check out the Arcane Academy. So if I click on the Arcane Academy, there's a button here for me to log in. I'll click login and notice how it is taking me to the custom domain that I had set up, auth.thearcaneacademy. And it's telling me I can continue with Microsoft Entra ID. So if I click that, I'll log in through Microsoft and it'll send me back Woohoo! Success. So that's the power of advanced orgs in Kind, where you can tailor the experience for each of your businesses to whatever their requirements are. So that's the power of advanced orgs in Kind. You can go ahead and edit the brand of each org. You can add a custom domain for each org, do multi-factor authentication, have custom authentication, different connections, and plenty more. Hope that was useful and thank you for watching.